discussing only important points related to USMLE. Okay, Baker cyst is a swelling due to an increase in the synovial fluid. There is a back in the back of the knee joint where is a popliteal fossa. You can sometimes feel a swelling and that is due to the, that can be a Baker cyst. That is what the location of the Baker cyst is. This sometimes can be confused with the popliteal artery aneurysms. So uh, you need to investigate and treat. Since it is not a much important topic, so I am not going to discuss in detail. So it's so it is seen in the patients with uh, arthritis like rheumatoid arthritis, cartilage, uh, like a particular meniscus tear. Uh, Baker's cyst can also be associated with the tear of meniscus. So this is not um, uh, okay. Sorry, the diagnosis is confirmed. By confirmed by the ultrasonography so since uh, it's uh, not uh, so much uh, what you call uh, uh, life-threatening or very dangerous lesion so it's uh, just a matter of swelling behind the knees so what you need to do is uh, the diagnostic test is ultrasonography rather than doing MRI MRI is the best of course but the ultrasonography you can but before that ultrasonography clinically is the best then you can do the ultrasonography okay Okay, treatment is no treatment unless they are symptomatic. So if they are asymptomatic and uh, there is a swelling and they are doing well, so no need to treat. That's very important. Okay, sometimes they feel a tightness or a stiffness behind the knees. Okay, swelling behind the knees that may get worse when they stand. When that's very important. Okay, uh, may sometimes uh, feel uh, this when you bend over your knees or uh, straighten it all the way. That's very important. Uh, okay, the surgery if it's very symptomatic and it's very important, uh, very big, so you can do the surgery before doing, before confirming the diagnosis. You need to do ultrasonography because sometimes it can be a popliteal artery aneurysm. So popliteal artery aneurysm, if you rupture it, you know the complications. So better to do ultrasonography, confirm the diagnosis, do the surgery if symptomatic. Ice packing can be done, even heart fermentation can be done. Okay. So this is what uh, I want to tell you. Thank you so much for watching my video. It's not very important topic, but just go through once. That's it. Okay. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please do subscribe to my channel.